Hey, what's up all you do-it-yourselfers? My name is Dylan Taylor, and this is Dylan's DIY Workshop. Now, today I am going to share something with you guys that I haven't talked about in quite a while, and that is that I actually make pipes to sell them, and I'm finally getting back into this. I spent the last six months making vlogs on a different YouTube channel because I thought that it could blow up faster, and basically what I was trying to do is like make a career out of YouTube as quickly as possible so that I could sustain myself and then move back into what I love doing, which is making things. I don't know why I did that, but I realized that this channel was growing the entire time that I was doing all of that, so I decided to come back to it in the midst of struggling to pay for car insurance and drive all the way to my girlfriend's house. I've decided that I'm going to start selling pipes online and other things that I make online so if there's any small project that you guys see on YouTube it'll probably end up on my Etsy shop which is what I'm here to talk to you guys about and that is that I just opened it and the four items that are going to be on it by the time this video comes out are this pipe right here number 14 and I made this a long time ago so this is one of the original pipes that I actually made number 14 the 14th pipe I've ever made to get you guys familiar with where I'm at now this is pipe 48 and I'm on 50 will be the next pipe that I make. So this is pipe 48 right here. It's the one with the brass wire and the acrylic mouthpiece right here. I, yes, that's how I made it in the video. So that's 48. We also have number 15 right here and it has a ultra high polish on this sapwood walnut square bowl with a white oak stem that is not removable. It is fixed. And then also pipe number nine. This is one of the first, the original 10 pipes that I ever made. And most of them were sold straight to people that I knew personally. So this is pipe number nine going up to my Etsy shop. And all of these, I assume you guys will find them fairly affordable. I'm asking, I think around $40 Canadian for each one of these. Now, obviously, depending on uh, what they are, they might be more, they might be less, how much work went into it, how many different kinds of materials, all those different things. And I'm also working on this presidential pipe, I guess you could call it. It's going to be a very high quality with, it's going to be a very high quality pipe that has a lot going into it. And there will definitely be a YouTube video on that. I'm going to work metalworking into woodworking and tenons in mortises, round mortise and tenons, I don't know what you'd call that, but it's all going to work together and it's going to be an absolutely amazing pipe. So I hope you guys will check that out when it comes out. So I, I will be selling that pipe as well, a small run of those, they will obviously be more expensive. But if you guys are interested in purchasing any of the things that I've made, Go ahead and let me know in the comments of this video and I can put it up on the Etsy shop or you can contact me directly. Like I said, this is just going to help me keep doing what I love doing and I've realized that this is the community that I need to be in. This community of makers where I can sit here and I can make something. I can I could take this file and I could work on this, this thing that I'm making right here. I could just work on this for hours while I'm listening to podcasts of other people that have made it and make things and I can brainstorm with other people that are in the same field and cross ideas and there's so many things and there's just so many kind people and this is just what I want to do so this is going to be a stepping stone for me and I obviously won't be doing it forever because there will be bigger and different things in the future that I'll be working on but if you guys want a piece of I guess you could say history they will be for sale on my Etsy shop There'll be a link in the description of this video along with all my other ones. But I just wanted to make a very quick announcement on that as, as itself because uh, I'm just excited. I don't know whether this is going to go well. I don't know whether any of you are even going to want to buy any of these. But if you are, they're all for sale there. And if you guys want something custom, email me and we can work something out for sure. I actually love pipe making and... I'm going to see if I can get a lathe set up here so that I can work on all the different things pipe related and I don't think my dad wants me to have a lathe in the house but maybe if we get like enough likes on a video we can get one in here. You know what I'm saying? Something like that. I will work on getting a lathe somewhere in here, whether it's big, small. I just would like to be able to turn the pipe bowls and pipe blanks 
on a lathe in the same spot that I could just come over here and use a file on it. Basically have everything self-contained. I'd need a I wouldn't need a drill press. I would use a hand drill. I never have liked using a drill press for drilling any part of a pipe because I find that there's just so much more control with a hand drill. Now, obviously, you can't drill a perfectly straight line. I know that. But I find it a lot better than clamping things down that. Or maybe it's just because my drill press was a piece of crap and it never went straight. Because you could twist it this way and this way to drill cool holes, but it would never stay 90 degrees. All right guys, that is enough rambling. So if you guys would like to purchase any of these or would like to request something for me to make you, please check out my Etsy shop. Thank you guys so much. I will see you all in the next one. Also, I just finally started my Patreon. I'm still setting it up. I don't have any pictures on it for the backdrop, but if you guys would like to support me there, I will have a card at the end of this video for you to support me on Patreon. Also a link in the description. We'll see you guys all next time. Peace out. Sorry, that's not how I end the videos. If you're new, please subscribe. If you're already subscribed, please share this video with a friend. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, give it a big old thumbs up. We will see you guys all next time. Uh, peace out.